Hey everybody, it's Brad with The Big Family Homestead. In today's video, we're doing a review on something that I think might interest a lot of you out there. And that is the New Air Model AI215SS Portable Ice Maker. So here we go. So here's the scoop, folks. Uh, the folks over at New Air approached us recently about doing a review on one of their products. And ironically, we just moved to this new house and the refrigerator we have does not have an ice maker. And so we were actually looking at getting an ice maker and then these folks contacted us. I thought, perfect, this will be, be great. Uh, however, I was open and honest with them and I told them I will be telling the truth. Period, end of story, even if it does not put your product in a great light. And they said, bring it on. So here we go. We're going to check this sucker out. Uh, and also, by the way, I think that this is a kind of a thing that, that the preparedness minded crowd should probably keep in mind because there's a lot of reasons why you might want to have an ice maker on hand that don't include cooling off your delicious beverage. Think about it like this. What happens if you've got some kind of medicine that you need to keep cold? Hmm? What happens if someone gets sick and you need a way to cool them off uh, in those what-if situations of life? There's a lot of reasons to have ice on hand would be a very, very good thing. So we're going to go ahead and open this bad boy up, see what it's like, test it out, and I will give you my honest, Scout's Honor, opinion. So here we go. All right, so right on the box it says that we can make up to 50 pounds, 50 pounds of ice a day uh, with this machine. And says that the cycle only lasts 6 to 14 minutes. You can see through the top, easily remove the, or easily move the handles. It has a touch uh, pad for, uh, I'm sure, turning it on and off. We'll find out. And it's got 12, 12, count them, pieces of ice per cycle. And you can adjust the cubic size, the cube size. So I think it's going to be interesting. I, I think it's going to be cool. Uh, and I think it's going to be useful if it will do what it says it will do. Side note right here. I already, already like this packaging and I'll tell you why. I hate styrofoam. Styrofoam makes my skin crawl. When I hear it, it's worse than nails on a chalkboard. And they didn't use styrofoam. They used the better stuff. They used this stuff. Yay. And voila, I give you the new Air AI 215 series portable ice maker. Let's check this thing out. Now there is a little warning thingamajigger in here that I thought was worth reading. Uh, so, well, here we go. This appliance is not intended for use by persons, including children, with reduced physical, sensory, or mental capabilities. Hmm. Or lack of experience and knowledge, unless they have been given supervision or instruction concerning use of the appliance by a person responsible for their safety. Sure, I'm allowed to use this thing. Now, one thing here on the power on the back of the unit it says the ice making current takes 2.1 amps, and to harvest it takes 3.2 amps. Uh, so, that keep that in mind if you're running off of a generator, it might not be an issue at all. But solar, you always have to take into account the power usage. Okay, one quick note, uh, the manual does say to let the unit sit upright uh, to let the refrigerant settle for about two hours before you use it. Uh, so we've done that, we've cleaned it out, we've wiped it out, we've washed the basket, time to plug her in and see what we got. So we got the unit plugged in, I'm going to go ahead and fill up the reservoir here, the water reservoir. Come on. So we got it powered on. Our cube size is selected, now it's going to go through a little bit of a process, about a three minute process before it starts doing its thing and we'll be back and check it out. So now while this thing is making ice, which it's doing, it's, it's doing its thing, it's making noises and squirty things and sounds and it's doing its thing. Uh, my first impression on the unit is that it's a sharp looking unit, I like the stainless steel, it feels sturdy, it was well packed. 
I, I get the impression that it's pretty easy to move around. There's nice handles. It's not too heavy. Uh, I think that anybody with a reasonable amount of strength could, could move this around without any issue. And so my initial opinion about the build, because you never know about a build until you've you know, had it for six months, but my initial impression is that it's, it's solid. Okay, so about seven minutes in, we just heard that it cycled and it has made ice. Let's see. It's cold, this ice. Look at that, it's kind of got a little weird tube thing on it there. But it's cold, it's ice, and it made it in about seven-ish minutes. All right, now in terms of price, where are we at? What's the thing cost? Now on the new air site, and this is 2017 September, because I'm sure prices change and you know, as materials change, but 2017 in uh, September, the new air website says it is $279.99, and I did look and find it on Amazon for $269.13. Now, that said, we've run this thing through the paces, it's, it's, uh, we've done the smalls, mediums, and large ice cubes, and at this point in the game, uh, we've let the, the large ice cubes cycle uh, three times, and I noticed that it puts out 12 cubes per cycle. So it's running about seven minutes a cycle, uh, so I figure we'll show you what we got, and then, uh, well, check this out. So here is how much ice has been made in about 21-ish minutes. And they're nice sized cubes, but uh, I, I, I'm not gonna be the judge of their worthiness. No, no, no. We're gonna try another guinea pig. So, mama, we have made ice. Is it cold? Yes. Is it ice? Yes. Give it a taste. It's cold water. It's cold water? Mm -hmm. Frozen water? No. The water's not frozen. The ice is the frozen. The ice is frozen, yes. So it worked. Yes, it worked. Our plan worked. Yes. And actually, ironically, uh, we've got these big mason jars, and that it did take all of that ice, it filled it all the way up, yeah. to give you an idea of how much it'll make in about 20 minutes, but ice. It made ice. Okay, so end of the day opinion on the New Air AI 215SS portable ice maker. Um, it does what it says it'll do. It's a good looking unit, feels solid. You never can tell on the, you know, the, the overall worthiness of the build unless you've had it for a while. But my opinion right now is that it's a solid product. Uh, when you talk about the price, you're gonna have to get a refrigerator that has a freezer for a lot more money to do the same thing. Now, one negative that I think they should have considered adding, uh, yes, it's a portable unit, but I still think that they should have had the option for you to plug in a water line if you have a water line so that you could do an autofill. Um, but that said, for us it doesn't matter and I think for a lot of people it won't matter, but it's nice enough looking and it feels sturdy that you might want to keep it right on the, the counter all the time and so that would have been a nice convenience. However, $279, I think it's a great deal. Uh, you can make 50 pounds of ice every day and that's enough for most families for a lot of applications. And the ability to do this on a generator, or even if you've got a nice solar setup, that's great. I mean, the regular homeowner, this is a no-brainer. It's a great product, I think, in my opinion. I think it's gonna be an awesome addition for our family. And uh, so if you're interested, there is a link down below to find out more information on the New Air product there. Uh, we'll leave a link in the description. Uh, but in my opinion, I think it's a solid product for a solid price. And, uh, well, I'm going to make some more ice. So, Brad with the Big Family Homestead, you guys have an amazing day.